Hello ladies and gentlemen, my name is Martin and welcome to another Trading 212 episode. Now before we get into it, I would like to say if you're watching this video and you're not subscribed, can you please subscribe to the channel? We are very close to breaking the 100 subscriber mark. Currently on 99, this is actually a live subscriber count and as you can see, we're currently on 99. I just wanted to hit the three digit digits. It's so annoying. Um, but yeah, currently on the 99, so I'd very much appreciate if you can just uh, subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. It'd be really sick if we can break the 100 subscriber mark, because uh, I'm very happy with how this channel has been growing recently. And yeah, it's overall been, a, been pretty sick. But I have some bad news, some very bad news regarding the uh, the trading. Let's take a look, shall we? And it's kind of gone to shit. <laughs> um, okay, so I have some screenshots, which I'll show and explain now. So as you can see, literally everything went not my way. Like everything went the opposite for how it should be. See the spike up there, the spike up there. Like seriously, the two currencies just completely screwed me. Or oh, it was a currency and the gold, I think. I'm not too sure. But as you can see, then it started to auto cash us out. So basically, I had insufficient margin because I have so many trades that are in the negative. And when you see that margin at the top of your screen, when it basically hits a very, very low amount, um, it will start to basically get uh, get out of the trade. But we did make one profit, so there is some life, but it's not looking very good at the moment at all. So yeah, let's see if we can do something and about it. And yeah, those it. screenshots basically uh, show the outcome of this. Basically, this minus 2,000 or this whole minus one or the plus 1000 was actually one of the tr actually one of the trades that I incorporated with all the rest of these trades but this minus 2000 minus 8000 was took out automatically because of an insufficient margin now basically that means is when this number this percentage here actually goes down to zero so it has to automatically close the trade otherwise the account will liquidize and everything will just die basically so it has to end end of some of the trades uh, for the account to be able to be open and for some funds to be in the account which is um not very good because that's 10,000 gone right now and this is minus 2,000 minus 3,000 currently on minus 5,000 and we only have an equity of now three and a half thousand yeah not too good not too good at all all these trades were made basically on the same day um you know 30th 30th first and these trades were i have been up for a little bit longer but i've just basically hit the shitter um if we have a look at some of these bad boys we will see that the uh the ust to the japanese yen is incredibly disappointing because look how much it, it grew let's go actually go to the four hour view look at that climb Look how it's been recently, you think it's gonna drop and I'll continue to climb, like this whole thing of mine where I think, okay, it's dropped now a little bit, it's gonna drop even further, basically cost me this like whole account in the progress of this account, me thinking that because it's dropped, it's gonna drop even further, no, I have to rethink, reanalyze, and know that that isn't the only thing that's gonna happen, um, I had confidence that it was gonna happen and it was wrong, so... There's nothing I can do about that. Um, we do have a gold on a buy as well, and it did actually drop quite a bit. Yeah, funny that I do a lot of sells, and the one buy I decide to do goes the opposite way. But it's okay. So basically, what I'm going to do is I'm going to see how this is looking in the next couple of days. If these hit either zero, you know, basically if it gets better, I'm going to continue with this account. However, if it stays the same, I have no choice but to reset the account. Um, yeah, look, minus 75%. That literally tells all. Minus 75%. Literally, I'm at the rock bottom of what I like of what it could be. I'm at the rock bottom. <laughs> yeah, not good at all. However, it's okay. Uh, if any, if 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 it's, if it stays, I'd say if this equity doesn't go to at least five or six thousand, I'm going to reset the account and just start again, start fresh because, yeah, I mean, there's literally no point in having having this at such a low value when I can just reset the account. But um, this is going to be the end of the episode. If you enjoyed, make sure you like, comment down below what you want me to trade with, and yeah, like I said, please subscribe to the channel. It will help me out massively. Um, so it would be cool if you could break that hundred subscriber mark. But sorry that these trades didn't work out. It's actually crazy. One, two, three. 
four or five trades and only one of them turned a profit. So <sighs> crazy stuff, crazy, crazy stuff. We could have made probably about 10 or 20,000 in these trades if they were just flipped. If they were flipped, if this if this gold was a sell, if this this if this if the, if the dollar to the yen was a buy, we'd have so much money. Like, it's, but it's just the way the way of how forex trading works. But like I said, uh, we'll see how it is in the next couple of days. I probably will start a new account, but it's okay. Um, yeah, because it's all cool. I love starting again and everything. It's all cool. No need to worry. If you did enjoy, make sure, like I said, to leave a like, comment down below, and I'll see you guys in the next episode of our trading two on two series. Make sure to have a nice day. Subscribe to the channel, and peace.